I'm Professor Indra Besegra. Let's look at hallmarks of sound research. There are 10 hallmarks. I will illustrate those 10 hallmarks using a research study. This research study investigated the selection of interim CEOs by board of directors. The first hallmark should be the motivation. Why is a study has been conducted? Why a research problem has been looked into? Why should it be looked into right now? In this study, they argued more boards are hiring temporary CEOs, but temporary CEOs are associated with negative performance. But the question is, why do boards hire them? And what contextual factors contribute to that? Little is known about it. The second is the purpose of this study. So in this study, they came up with a, a clear question. What contextual factors influence boards to hire temporary CEOs? The third hallmark of sound research is the rigor of the research undertaker. In this study, they argued using two theoretical perspective, agency and human capital perspective, the body of evidence and understanding that selection and succession of CEOs is one of the key ways both align with shareholders and management. So that became the foundation, a theoretical foundation to conduct this research. The fourth is this study should be replicable. Here in this study, they examined 375 such CEOs between 1998 and 2005 in publicly listed firms in the US. So someone wants to replicate this study, they could do that easily. The fifth is testability. So to test the contextual factors, this study operationalized variables, the identified factors, and to support these factors, they obtain data from two databases. One is CompuStat, database. The other is Thompson Financial Multiple Sources database and data, that database provided information about the CEOs. The sixth hallmark is parsimony. Parsimony means that looking at optimum number of factors we can explain what we want to explain. So in this study, they wanted to explain about the interim CEOs hiring. With In this study, they used 13 variables to examine, examine it. So they found 13 variables as the optimum number of variables that most explain the interim CEOs hiring. So those six factors relates to the design of the study. The remaining hallmarks I'm going to talk about relates to the findings. The seventh hallmark is the precision and confidence. What we mean by precision is that the results is close to reality. They looked at a practical problem, 
looked at something that is happening. So the findings are close to reality. And they analyzed and came up with the findings and these findings is not absolutely certain but has a level of confidence. In social sciences, it is a minimum level of confidence required is 95% level of confidence. And they have set that level of confidence in the study. Eight is the objectivity. Objectivity means that the study has used data and the findings are based on data. So this data from these databases that I mentioned to you are available publicly and anyone can use that those data and then should come up with the with same findings. The ninth is to what extent these findings are generalizable. This study looked at the US publicly listed companies, therefore, using that sample, they can talk about, they can generalize their findings to the US publicly listed firms. The final factor of the final hallmark is the contribution. After finding all this, what is the contribution it is making? What they found in this study was both higher temporary CEOs when there is no apparent air. So they highlighted from this study, they are highlighted the importance of a succession plan for CEOs because CEO selection is one of the important decisions boards make. So there are 10 hallmarks of scientific research.